Thanks for checking this out. I am going to be doing a very, very quick stream slash video of the brand new war bond. I'm going to look at all the items. There's stuff for the ship upgrades. There's a new mission type. We're going to try to do that, all of that in this video. This is a daily live stream channel where we do a talk show. We just talked yesterday about Helldivers 2. Huge turnout for that. Thank you. If you're looking for more regular quick updates, be sure to subscribe to Helldivers 2 Updates. That is the name of the channel. YouTube.com forward slash. You can just do at Helldivers 2 Updates. That's our updates channel. There's shorts. There's quick videos. I'm going to end the previous stream about Hellblade 2 and bring people over with a redirect and thank you to everybody who was there for that. If you didn't see my comment uh, commentary on that, pretty disappointed in some of the stuff. So I am going to go ahead and buy uh, this premium war bond. And let's do it. And then we're going to take a look at it. The Democratic Detonation. Uh, there is, looks like, three pages similar to some of the other war bonds that we have done. So we've obviously got the super credits and then we have the squat victory pose. Uh, and then we have a nice player card, and then we have the thermite grenade uh, that was that was promoted in the in the thing. And let's take a look here at what these do: increase throwing range by thirty percent, provides fifty percent limb health. I would really like for transmog to come to this game, right? I would really really like that uh, because I they, they keep doing the same perks whether it's recoil or throw distance. And my favorite is the the one where it, it keeps you from dying 50% of the time. I'll show you my favorite armor perk in a second. You might not know about it. It's not in the game all that often, and it saves my skin a whole lot. And there we go. Uh, I think that's a very, very cool-looking helmet. And then we have a, uh, a new cape here. That's actually my favorite cape, this, this war bond. So that'll be, that's going to be a quick buy for me. I really, really like that one. I'm going to just buy that and equip that right now. And then I'm going to buy the adjudicator right away uh, because I want to try it out as well. Uh, I'm going to buy and equip that new weapon. Always like showing off new weapons. Uh, this thing's going to be an 80 damage with a recoil of 50, capacity of 25, and a fire rate of 550. So we can compare that to some of the other weapons soon. Another player card here, Eagle's Fury. And then Demolition Specialist. Further reduces recoil when crouching by prone, increases initial inventory holding uh, grenade capacity by two. So once again, this perk shows up all of the time. Again, this is why I want Transmog. I would love to be able to wear that and then pick basically pick my own perk. I really think they should let us do that. New head uh, helmet here, Demolition Specialist. Another new cape here, Eagle's Fury. And then this is the Expert Extraction Pilot. This lowers the time it takes for the Extraction Shuttle to reach the Extraction Beacon. So another nice booster there. Uh, the Eruptor Gun is going to be medium armor penetrating and explosive. It's going to do 380 damage. It only has 5 on the capacity, recoil 75, and a fire rate of 25. So that's going to probably function as like a long distance, almost like sniper or explosive gun. Uh, more super credits, and then a courtly bow victory pose. And then we have the boxer on the next page uh, as a victory pose. We have a player card, Freedom's Tapestry. Here is the grenade pistol, one-handed explosive. Uh, wish that I could buy that right now to show that to you, but I can't. Here's the devastator. Further reduces recoil when crouching or prone. Provides 50% resistance to explosive damage. So, like, at least that one's sensible, like, as a heavy. Uh, I kind of like that. And then I will look at the new um, uh, things we can get. Uh, I'm being told in the Discord, Alapark says there's new ship upgrades as well. Uh, I'll be sure to check those in a moment. And then we have Freedom's Tapestry. That's actually a really nice looking cape as well. And then the Devastator helmet. I like that. That's got a cool look to it. And then here's a weapon uh, that some of you might have forgotten about. The Crossbow with 420 on the damage, capacity 5, recoil 35, and a fire rate of 50. That is explosive super credits. So that is the Democratic Detonation War Bond right there put on display for you. You guys all came over from the first stream. Do me a quick second. There's over 300 of you here. Smash the heck out of that like button. Let's get our first 100 likes. That'll be super, super helpful. And I'm going to show you the perk that I really, really like. Okay? I'm going to show you the perk that I really, really like. Um, and let me let me change all of this because I haven't been in here in a while. Uh, there's the incendiary. I bought that recently, but I really, really like the impact grenade the most. Uh, so when I go to the armory, the perk is called Democracy Protects. It says 50% chance to not die when taking lethal damage. Prevents all damage from bleeding if chest hemorrhages. I just really like Democracy Protects. I do. And I really, really wish, uh, I really, really wish 
that we could get uh, that perk in more places. Or as I said, just give me the ability to transmog so I could have that perk, but then wear any of the armor uh, that I uh, that I like. Right? That would be um, exciting. I would like that because there are so many great armor pieces uh, in this. So that armor is busted. I love it. It's it, it's. I, I tell you, it cuts your deaths in half. I really think that it does. Okay, so ship upgrades. Um, are these? I, I'm not sure which ones are new, but I feel like this one is here. Superior packing methodology, resupply boxes, refill support weapons with the maximum number of carryable magazines. Um, I would need this one here, but I have low funds. Um, atmospheric monitoring, orbital HE barrage spread reduced by 15. I don't know if that one's new or not. XXL weapons bay, eagle stratagems that drop multiple bombs will drop one additional bomb. Uh, enhanced combustion, fire damage from stratagems is increased by 25%. Circuit expansion, lightning arcs fired from weapons and turrets jump to one additional enemy. That's not new. I'm pretty sure that's been in there before. Uh, blast absorption, sentries take 50% less damage from explosions. Every section got a new one. The bottom one of each section is new. So blast absorption is new. Circuit expansion is new. I was incorrect. These bottom ones are all new. Enhanced combustion, XXL weapons bay, and atmospheric monitoring. Okay, so even though I'm kind of behind on ship upgrades, my my instinct was correct. Those are all new. Um, I don't know if there's been any new stratagem snuck in today. I'm not seeing any. uh, And nobody's reporting to me that there's any that have been snuck in. So I'm kind of saving uh, my... I'm kind of saving my my currency and requisition and all that for it. Okay, so now that we looked at the war... Our next victory rapidly approaches. That's right. Let us cleanse the galaxy of alien scum. Okay, we got an incoming message from Super Earth. This is the thing that if you haven't seen this yet, this is when we learned that the automatons were coming back and uh, with a vengeance there. Okay. And right now, we have to succeed in defending at least five planets. I need to kill ten enemies using the expendable anti-tank, so I'll probably try to bring one of those down to do that. Um, Okay. Vernon Wells. Is there a place that's liberated? We need defense right now. Is there one that's doing better than another? They're all pretty bad. So. Okay, so what's the new mission... Defend planet. Repel the automaton invasion fleet attacking this planet. Okay. Evacuate high value assets. This is the new mission. Right? The new mission is that brick. So you can't play. It doesn't look like you can play the new mission at four. So we're going to have to bump the difficulty to five, which you guys have been asking me to bump the difficulty anyway. This is a 20 minute mission. So let's show this one off. The new mission's like a tower defense. Yeah, I'm interested in this. People have been really, really praising it. Thanks for the strong turnout for gameplay, guys. I appreciate it so, so much. We did hit 27 members today. I've already gifted the five that I owe. Make sure you guys are smashing the like button. We need about 30 more likes. A lot of you guys came over from the first stream and you're lurking. Just take that quick second to do that. Okay. Now, now, Paris said we need to bring down Quasar. Man, still playing on four. Hey, man, cut me some slack. I just play to chill. I don't. I don't pay to. I don't pay to sweat. I like the EMS. Um, I do like the auto cannon, but I'll bring the Quasar instead. Um, probably good to bring some uh some turrets. EMS mortar sentry. I'm seeing a lot of EMS mortar sentry, so I don't we don't need triple. Uh that You know what? A generator. Let's bring a generator. I'll play more support role. Uh okay. I don't even know if this is going to matter. Localization confusion is probably not even going to work. And did it save my equipment? It did. Okay, let's test out this new mission. And we're testing out a new gun as well. 
Yo, it's good sweat. How are you? I'm gonna turn down the game just a touch so that I'm not getting overwhelmed. Okay, so that's that. You can put it on semi or auto. I want to try it on auto. Ooh, that's kind of bad. Yeah, let's switch back to semi. Oh, we've got other sites too. Oh, let's go. What do we do? Prepare your defenses. Oh, it's going to come in 48 seconds. All right. Where do they typically come from? <laughs> they can't come from there. I'm going to let you in on a secret. Raking a yard is a huge suck. Oh, they can probably come in here. Right? Oh, down there. Okay. Not closing any walls, I see. Oh, you can close the walls? I've not... This is the first time I've played it. Yeah, it looks like they're closing some of the walls. Put a sentry there. Oh, dope. They're like trying to get in. This is sick. I'm telling you, th th this game is right for raids. No, that's not going to work against him. This gun feels pretty good. What the heck hit me? I missed. Can those drop? Did the did the dropship shoot me? Requesting sentry. New mag. I don't even know what hit me. Lona with the raid talk, be still my beating heart. <laughs> Rockets launched one of eight. Man, somebody keeps stealing the glory. Got it. So many explosions. Trying to run from the grenade. Oh, golly. 
What? I was hoping it would crash into the other one. Well, my sentry's gone already. Yo, can we get 13 more likes really quickly, guys? Hurry up, hurry up. We're still in the early moments of the stream. You gotta get that momentum. Oh, oh, oh. I can use this. I'm trying to get kills with this for the one. I don't know how many I have to get. We might be able to get somebody over here. Over here. That EMS mortar is awesome. That guy keeps coming there. <laughs> he keeps coming there and I shoot him and he drops his grenade. <laughs> They're going to have to start despawning them. Oh, that was super dope timing over there, bro. You guys get any more of those... You guys get any more of those EATs for me? Can I get a little more of those EATs? Thank you. How many did I get? How many did I get? Ten enemies. I got one. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh bad. This is bad. Let us back in. <laughs> that freaking auto mantle, bro! I was like, this is not what I meant to do. Oh, I tried to get it through. <laughs> more EAT, more EAT. Oh, it clipped the edge of the freaking ground. Trying to get underneath. Not happening. Oops, sorry. Oh, I keep doing that. It'd be pretty nice if, um... Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, I was hoping there was an EAT over here. I was going to leave the door open. Got him right on the back. <laughs> I left the door open. I left the door open. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry, everybody. That was me. They were like, who the frick left the door open? Da, 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 da,
This is really bad! Oh! I went to get the stims. I went to get the stims. We got overrun. We got so overrun, bro. All right, coming back in. Okay, there we go. Oops. Oh, the placement of this is really unfortunate. I can't get rid of that. It still it still is resetting my voice. Roger. Where's the crosshair? Okay, that's done. <laughs> that's done. I need some grenades. I don't need stims, though. I'll wait. I'll wait. I was hoping if I could get it to fall late like that, like it would fall on them. Ten seconds on the sentry. Any more of those EATs lying around? Yes, 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 yes. No, I don't want a freaking mantle. Mission completed. I got three. This is Pelican One, preparing for touchdown. Where? Where is it touched down in this one? Okay. It was like they knew I was going to ask. It was like, follow me. Countdown initiated. Stand by for takeoff. We did it. They added new ship upgrades, new order requires special missions, and those missions don't have samples. Yeah, they need to reward samples for missions like this so that you get them anyway to motivate people to not feel like they're missing out on their sample grind. You know?
Oh, Paris says, I've got first dropships if you want to take second. Yeah, I didn't even look over and see that. Why should someone play the new mission? Well, it's attached to two other missions, Eugene. Like, is it, you know what I'm saying? It's not, you do three. Like, I have to do this and I have to do two more, and the two more do have samples. Man, two of you guys are bloody. Goodness. Take a bath. Ugh. Kind of gross. Man. Some of y'all need to you know, keep it a little clean out there, dude. Kind of gross. Um. Oh, yeah, to come down here, I got to spend 32 more medals. 14? No, oh, there's no clean purchase right now. Oh, yeah, there is. All right. Yo, Chris Lee, welcome back. Make sure if you're paying for your own membership, make sure to get out of the gifted tier. I will protect democracy at all costs. Yeah, please save my dadgum choice. An awesome mission yeah the mission is really really fun and then we've got retrieve valuable data and then we've got emergency evacuation like we've we've done these tons of times so every sector in the galaxy must be purged of the alien menace there it is Chris Lee thanks for upgrading to the standard membership we only do that because we, we actually create content specifically for people that are paying for their own memberships and gifteds get to sort of sample some of that so if you get a gifted membership from the community you can get into the discord uh, and you can get into some of the content I am I am forgetting I keep forgetting to do the members only shorts uh, you guys seem to like those and everybody was getting those um, so The evac ones suck. At uh, difficulty nine, the defense missions drop a tank or two every single wave. I think that's awesome. I think that's a glimpse. I think that's a glimpse into what they can do with this game. I really do. I think they can. I think they can get into a good spot um, with it. So. But I didn't want to belabor the point. Um, this is not exactly the thing that we do on this channel. And the response to the Helldivers gameplay, uh, you know, has been has been somewhat lukewarm and declining when we do it here. Not because I don't think people are interested. The talk show yesterday was amazing. Uh, but I think in general, uh, people are just looking for the new stuff. Okay, see the new stuff. Cool. Uh, and then that's pretty much it. We're, again, we're not really a gameplay stream. So I'm, I'm setting up the writer's room right now. I just wanted this to be like a quick 20 to 30 minute stream, sample the new mission, and, uh, and show off the new war bond and the new updates. And then we will... The last time we did this, the video got a lot more um, people to find it because it was a short video. And we didn't, we didn't like belabor the point. Um, it, ser- it serves a better purpose uh, for the, the Helldivers fans out there that are just looking for the basic info for us to not just hang out and keep on playing. They're mainly looking for the war bond, the updates of the ship, and the things like that, as well as potentially the new mission. So I'm going to spam a link in chat, and we going to get the heck out of here. I got to change it's 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 set up to be an auto starting writer's room and it's not right. So if you have upgraded to the $6 membership or higher, you get to come with us to this stream. 
where we plan the next day's shows, which not a lot of planning for tomorrow, but we'll uh, we'll kind of let you guys know what's going on, give you a head start and a heads up on what's going on. And there's a link in chat for those of you that like uh, that they can come to the writers' room if you're at that member tier or higher. Thanks so much for being a Reforge member or a hire. Uh, this is going to be another writer's room. This one might not be as much brainstorming. Um, we might even get into some gameplay. Sometimes I've been using these streams just to show you guys gameplay of where I am. Like We don't have a whole lot of planning to do for Friday, but I can let you know what's coming uh, and what to expect for Friday with respect to the shows and the various things that we're going to be doing, uh, as well as the fact that we're probably not going to hit the 2,500 uh, goal. And so we'll just roll that over to next week and see if you guys can't hit it next week on the member count. Um, we're closing in on 2300 again, which we hit last week, which you guys will get that Friday night. So I'm going to end the previous Helldiver stream and redirect folks over. And then I'll change that thumbnail.